Hey everyone, this is a quick video to demonstrate some features of the linked details plugin from Parallax team for Revit. A new request that we've had is for people to be able to, to load full sheets of details into a project that are linked back to the resource file. Uh, so we're now able to do that. Uh, I'm just in a detail project file, a resource file, if you will. As we can see, we have some details on a sheet and there are no parameters for the link detail tool quite yet. Uh, so what we're able to do is if we go to link details, we now have a new option for I am detail file. Uh, it's just kind of a, a funny way of naming it. But what we do is click on this and what it will do is tell you a few things about what's about to happen. Uh, so this lets us assign all of these drafting views, the parameters to themselves. Uh, there are 15 in this project as we can see. And then this enables us to use the load sheets from file option built into Revit and the parameters come with it. Uh, so if we click no, it'll just back out and not change anything. But if we move forward, we'll go ahead and click yes. It'll just think for a quick second. And now we can see that we've self-assigned those parameters that we can now use, which is pretty awesome. By default, it will set all of the drafting views in the project to themselves. So this GUID relates to itself and this path relates to itself as well. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll go ahead and save this uh, and then we'll close this file. And in a receiving file or a project file, what we'll do is we'll go to the tool or we'll go to the insert tab and we'll actually use the insert views from file from Revit since they have sheets built in. So rather than reinvent the wheel and build sheets into our tool, we just added that fourth button to be able to supplement this. So what we'll do is we'll navigate to my desktop. I have a linked details folder and we can see that my details file is available. So we'll go ahead and click open and we can pick the sheet of details now, the entire sheet. And we can see the preview in the preview window, which is really nice. So we'll go ahead and click OK. It'll think for a bit. You'll get some of the typical warnings and things you get with the insert views from file operation, but you'll see that all the parameters came with it. This gets interesting because let's go ahead and jump back in and change one of these. We'll change the detail pretty considerably. So I'll actually activate this view and we'll just wipe out a bunch of stuff. And I'll hit save in my detail file, that's the pink file close this and now when we navigate to the tool for updating link details we will see that we have the option of all of them in this specific case I want to modify detail 8 so I'll just select that one and click update it'll think for a moment and we'll see that that detail is now linked to its resource file so there it is that's a method for loading in whole sheets of details with our linked details tool it is a new button for i am detail file uh, you would only use it inside of a detail file but there it is one of the new features for links details for revit